this is the second annual equity school retreat uh, in Region 6. And uh, uh, based on the success of last year's and the feedback we got, we realized that the, the model of using it as a retreat, a weekend retreat in a lodge in the wilderness, um, really worked for this kind of an event. Our equity department has created a, a terrific curriculum for uh, bringing about not, not just an awareness of equity issues in the union and in the workplace and in our community, but I think it's going beyond simply accepting equity and, and aiming toward um, valuing, celebrating equity and developing strategies for dealing with inequitable practices in the workplace. Oh, this was a very enlightening opportunity. Um, I think that we've made some real connections and I think that the more things change, however, the more they stay the same. Um, we've made some leaps and bounds in terms of equity, but we still have a whole lot of work to do. And coming together for an evening or a weekend like this is, um, it's rejuvenating. It reminds us that we have work to do, but it also celebrates what we've been through and where we are right now. Les affaires que j'ai aimées le plus, c'est parler en nous, nous, nous autres et partager des expériences et aider un et l'autre à comment agir et comment à, à arrêter la discrimination sur chaque niveau. J'ai vraiment aimé l'aspect la, la, qu'on est ensemble et on partage. It's been an amazing experience. Um, we watched a film yesterday on justice for Aboriginal people and that really sat with me. Um, and we talked about um, justice for um, and reconciliation for Aboriginal and Indigenous peoples. Um, and it seems overwhelming. I, I felt compelled like you need to do something about it, but it feels completely overwhelming and where do you start? And I thought, you know, could you lobby the government? Could you do different um, activism type of things? Um, and then I thought, well, who's the government? The government are people, and I'm a person. And it can start with me, you know? It starts with me. So I thought the first thing I could do is say sorry. And I know I'm not the government. I know I'm not my ancestors, but I am sorry. Some of the topics in, in that were brought up and even uh, in the discussions we had in the class, uh, definitely we will be using that uh, in the local and even in our own agency that we work in. When I first attended these types of courses was years ago, it challenged a lot of my misconceptions. I think oftentimes equity issues are hidden below the surface a little more than they used to be. We certainly encourage all of our members to, to know that they can attend equity schools in their regions um, and all they have to do is get onto the OPSU website or contact their local president, their OPSU staff or their executive board members in their region and they'll get on the list. We've bonded as a family. I love my OPSU family. <laughs>